I know what you're thinking. Okay, you're thinking, does he happen to have a particularly athletic grandma? No, I do not. That's exactly why it's so embarrassing that she could tackle better than you. I just wish the Bucks could be better. How do you get this thing off, man? Hey, do you have a screwdriver somewhere? I'm sorry, um, are you me? No, I'm Brad Pitt. What's it look like? Yes, I'm you. Okay, man, I don't have time to explain. How are you me? I don't have time. I don't understand. You don't have to understand, okay? Do you have a screwdriver? So time travel's real, huh? Yeah, obviously, man. And 10 years from now, things get weird. So then, why are you here? There's only one way we can fix things. The Buccaneers have to win the Super Bowl. Are you sure? I know it sounds crazy, man, but in the 2028 presidential election, Tom Brady runs for president, all right? And he runs against the worst possible candidate you could think of. He does not win, and a big reason why he doesn't win is because of how poorly this last season went. I'm surprised they still care about the 2022 NFL season six years from now. Yeah, man, it was the last season we saw before COVID-20 shut everything down. I'm sorry, uh, what was that? I have to go. Help the Buccaneers win the Super Bowl. Help them win the Super Bowl. Make sure you, make sure you, make sure you help them. How am I supposed to do that? I'll send help. Hey, it's 17 year old you. I have this map. of youth but it's in three different places how am i supposed to know which one it is what i don't understand is how is this supposed to help the bucks win the super bowl well i mean that part's obvious we just give some water from the fountain of youth to tom brady it ages him 10 years backwards and then he plays like a 35 year old again wait brady plays for the bucks oh my god that's awesome it is pretty awesome but wait how are we going to get the water to brady we won't. What do you mean? The water is essentially the secret to immortality. I'm not giving that to someone I never met. What about the future? How bad can the future really be? Really bad. I heard Tom Hanks gets elected president. What's wrong with that? He seems nice. No, man, he's not nice. Turns out he's like super into eating babies. What? Yeah, man, it's fucked up. America gets into a whole civil war over it, and then that turns into a world war. Well, um, well, maybe we'll win the war. Does it matter? How could it not? Because either we lose, and that means that, I guess, eating babies is just a thing now, or we win, and we can't watch Tom Hanks movies anymore. Even Forrest Gump? Especially Forrest Gump. We gotta find Fountain of Youth, okay? It's in three places. How do we know which one we should go? Should we just try all three? No, absolutely not. Uh, I saw on the map, two of them are poisonous. Only one of them is the real Fountain of Youth. It said the one that's a true contender is the one you should go to. But what does that mean? Okay, wait, so uh, so this one is this one is in Jacksonville, so clearly not a contender. Even 10 years ago, that was true. And then the other two are, oh, I see, it's all the Florida teams, so Miami and Tampa. Wait a second, I, I don't understand, it's a paradox, right? I mean, if we give Tom Brady water from the fountain of youth, he will play like a 35-year-old and make the Buccaneers Super Bowl contenders, which means that it should be Tampa Bay. But right now, we haven't given him the water, so they're not contenders, meaning it's not Tampa Bay. Which one could it be? Yeah, but either way, Miami's a contender, so it's just obviously there. Oh, oh yeah, I guess, I guess that, I guess that makes sense. Well, I guess I gotta drive to Miami. Wait, that could actually be kind of fun, right? I mean, we could get some snacks. Uh, I noticed a game called the Animal Game. I guess you know it too, if you're me. So we could, we could have a... Oh, you know what? Smart. Yeah, I'll, I'll wait here. I'll wait here. And of course, if future us comes back, then I'll be here. Good thinking.
Beware! If you take from the fountain of youth, severe consequences will be suffered. Like what? For each bottle of water you take, someone in the world will die. You took just one. Good choice. Oh, hey, you're back. And you got two water bottles. Nice. So now you can drink your water bottle and be just like me. Yeah, I'm definitely not going to be uh, doing that. No, thank you. I will be waiting 10 years drinking it then. Oh, okay. I, I guess that makes sense. So how did you get those water bottles anyway? Did you have to like solve some crazy riddle, pull a sword out of a giant stone or something? Oh, it wasn't anything like that. No, uh, they just said that for every bottle I take, someone dies. Wait, you killed someone just for an extra 10 years of life? Yeah, hey, maybe we'll get lucky and it'll be Byron Leftwich. <laughs> Why did you just do that? I'm not gonna let you kill somebody just for an extra 10 years of life. Yeah, that's great, except for the fact that the person is already dead, so you just did that for nothing. Oh, oh, well, uh... You can't drink that. Why shouldn't I? The fate of the world depends on it. I'll just use the knowledge that I now have to make sure Tom Hanks doesn't win. Uh, yeah, what are you gonna do? I'll vote. You really think that's gonna make a difference? Hey, one vote absolutely does make a difference. I know you don't believe that. I'm you and I don't believe that. But if I get 10 more years of life, that means 10 more NFL seasons to watch. And 10 more years of living with the guilt of knowing what you've done. I had to watch Jameis Winston play quarterback for my team for five years, okay? I deserve this. I don't know who that is. Okay, but you will, and you won't love it. You can't drink that. No, dude, stop! No. We are gonna have to hardcore canvas for Brady in 2028. Should probably also stock up ahead of time on toilet paper for that whole COVID-20 thing. Good call. What's happened in the past 10 years anyway? Like, has Kanye put out anything good? Oh god, yeah, we got some, uh, we got some catching up to do.